terrible unless Dad is really feeling it. And now, this. And now, Last Week Tonight asks, how is this still a thing? This week, the Commonwealth Games. How is this still a thing? If you live in certain parts of the world, this week you're looking forward to one thing. We've got the Commonwealth Games coming up. Commonwealth Games. Commonwealth Games. Commonwealth Games. Welcome to the Friendly Games. In America, we not only don't know what the hell they're talking about, we couldn't tell you if you offered us $2,000. A new 50 pence piece marks the 20th celebration of these multi-country games to be held in the UK in 2014. That would be the Commonwealth Games. Here's a question. What the fuck are the Commonwealth Games other than the winner of the creepiest mascot on Earth competition? Well, imagine the Olympics without the United States, China, and Russia. Then imagine a track meet dominated by sprinters from Wales. Wales! And you have the Commonwealth Games, a competition that's only open to members of the British Commonwealth. The games began in the 1930s, just as the British Empire was falling flat on its face, and for some reason continue to this day. Once every four years, the world is treated to the spectacle of the Queen showing her full emotional range, from irritated in Victoria, to damp in Manchester, to bored in Melbourne. But why would she be bored? The Commonwealth Games feature all the world's top sports, such as squash, lawn bowls, competitive mountain biking, and netball, which is basically what basketball would be if you didn't have the rights to play basketball. As many of these games are British derived, it's no wonder that England has soared all the way to the top of second place of the medal count. And for non-sports fans, the games also offer opening and closing ceremonies that speak to our sense of wonder. Specifically the wonder of what an off-Broadway version of the Olympic ceremonies would look like. So tonight, we salute this week's Commonwealth Games, the historic display of a once mighty nation, gathering together the countries it lost and finding a way to lose to them once more. So the next time you're on Jeopardy, and the answer is the Commonwealth Games, the only possible question is, how is this still a thing?